Hi everyone, uh, my name is Emmalyn. Um, unfortunately, I got called into work this evening, so I can't make the um, Zoom meeting, but uh, here's my presentation. Um, so I feel like I should preface. Um, I have really bad insomnia, so I typically um, sleep in like increments throughout the night, and so I feel like I'm constantly dreaming, um, which, you know, isn't really great for like that deep REM sleep. Um, but I wanted to make a piece that kind of captured that, like, just kind of the, like, all of the dreams that I have all the time throughout the nights. Um, I do kind of struggle with remembering my dreams, um, which, I don't know, I've tried to, like, tap into it more, especially with, like, this, um project that we had to do um but I still like sometimes feel like it'll be like I'll wake up in the morning and I'll be like wow that was like a really crazy dream and then like the second that I try to remember it it like leaves me um but anyway so here's the piece I mostly work with um acrylic on canvas medium that's like what I'm most comfortable with um so I hope you guys enjoy <laughs> here it is um, so the background is, um, supposed to represent the sky at sunset. Um, it's all, like, because I chose the sky because I wanted to show the vastness of the dream world and like all of the possibilities. Um, and within that I have all of these, if you look really, really closely, they're all little eyeballs <laughs> that I painted. Um, and those represent uh, the glimpses into all of the potential futures, alternate realities, literally anything um, that comes to us in our dreams. Uh, one really cool feature about this painting that it's like the video doesn't really do it justice, um, but I varnished all the eyeballs so they're all shiny um, and the background is matte. Um, this piece probably took me, uh, maybe like five hours of, um, dot work, which, you know, my, my artwork is a little bit, um, I mean, that's, that's not very much time compared to how much time I've put into some of my pieces. Um, I'm definitely one of those long haul artists where I will work on a piece for years before calling it finished. Um, so cranking out something for a class this quick was, um, it was a fun little challenge for sure because I usually would not be able to crank out something like this so quickly. Um, my plan for later on down the road, just because you know I am that gal, um, I wanna make the eyeballs a little more like glossy, uh, make it a little more obvious that they are. Um, I also plan to paint the edges because I really like a nice finished canvas. Um, one thing that I think is kind of fun that I do in my art is I'll pick like a really bold color um, for the outside. Uh, for this one, I was probably thinking either like maybe like a bright teal or like something totally out of the color scheme and maybe do like a bright neon green or something crazy. I don't know. Um, but I really like this piece. I think it's beautiful <laughs> and I'm really proud of it. Um, one of my favorite parts about my dot work is being able to, like, every time I look at it, I feel like my brain can find a new pattern, um, just kind of, like, see how my hand, you know, went, if that makes sense. <laughs> like, you can kind of tell some areas the dots are a little closer, some they're, um, more spaced out, but, um, I thought this was a really cool representation of, uh, the dream world and all of its infinite possibilities. Um, thank you all so much for watching. Have a great night. <laughs>